just heard four different plants playing instruments using this device, which is called a plant wave. This was playing bass. You might have seen me looking over there sometimes. There is a little chime that was being played by a tree, and the piano was played by this plant here, and the vocals were played by this plant, and it's beautiful. This is technology I developed uh, about 11 years ago, and uh, the exploration was that I would go out into the forest and I would always feel really centered and connected and feel like in my creative zone out there. And I would often do field recordings and through those field recordings, I would find melodies in the wind or in bird songs and I would bring those back to my studio and connect to the feeling of that place and write music. And so for me, music, was always an expression of a place. And I started to think about what that meant for me. And I started to think about how, you know, a plant grows and, and maybe the way I write music, maybe the, maybe, or maybe writing a poem, maybe that same force that moves me to put pen to paper is the same force that is inspiring a plant to grow in a particular way. And so I started to think about what if I allowed the song of a place or the song of nature to come directly through and I could get out of the way. And I can say that I just played a song there and I didn't touch anything, so I guess I've achieved that. <laughs> and yeah, what, what I found is that not only are plants very active and we can use uh, these biorhythms from plants to make very beautiful music, but the plants are responding to shifts in the environment. And you can start to hear that in the music. That's why when I would hear the chime change, I would look over there because it's exciting to me. It's, something is happening. And... Um, Sometimes you'll notice if you, uh, if you have a plant wave, some of you may have one, um, if you're listening at home, just going about your day, uh, you might notice just in the middle of a conversation that it might shift into another, uh, it might shift an octave, or there might be a big change in an effect that's being controlled by the plant. And um, that's information that's information for us, right? There's a lot of beautiful synchronicities that are here for us on Earth, and plants are here to teach us to listen. And that's what this is about. So thank you all. Thanks. Yeah, thanks for being here. Um, tonight, we're going to have the plants. I'm basically DJing the plants. I'm going to be routing their info to different instruments and Eduardo and I are going to be collaborating and um, you know Eduardo's we, we, we played a little bit earlier we did this what three years ago with a whole band and now it's just us and it's I feel like we can go so much deeper with us and I'm really I'm really excited for this so um, yeah that's pretty much what I what I have to say and thank you all for for being here and, and thank you Eduardo for just creating a space for this to make sense right like nothing makes more sense than this right now and that's that's a really special situation you've created for yourself or we've created together so thank you for that So just to add a little bit to what Joe said, this is truly about listening and the plants react to how present you can be. So do really stay present and, and try to commit to these next few, these few minutes um, of this concert 
to really give yourself time to disconnect and and know that we are listening to these plants um, and if we had a hundred of these devices which one day I hope we do uh, we would actually understand that the, the jungle is speaking to us so if you can just allow us to really take you there deeply um, if you'd like to have a conversation do, do so uh, on that side of the hotel please no smoking and please be mindful of anyone next to you and around you because they might be really really present and really trying to go somewhere thank you <laughs>